Welcome back to the Red Carpet Ria, your go-to source for the latest in music industry news and drama. In today's episode, we're diving into a heated debate between some of hip hop's biggest names. Lil Yachty recently sparked controversy with his comments on New York fashion, claiming Atlanta is the real trendsetter. This didn't sit well with New York's finest, including Joel Santana and Fabio Foreign. Let's break down what happened and how each artist responded. Lil Yachty stirred the pot on his podcast, A Safe Place, by claiming that New York has been copying Atlanta's fashion style. He specifically called out the Bronx and Queens for lacking originality, questioning if they even shop in Manhattan. This bold statement quickly drew criticism, especially from those who see New York as a long-standing fashion hub. Joel Santana was quick to respond on Instagram, defending New York's fashion influence. He highlighted his and Jim Jones' impact on hip-hop style and mentioned other notable New York fashion icons like ASAP Rocky and Fabulous. Santana made it clear that New York has always been a trendsetter in the fashion world. Brooklyn star Fabio Foreign also jumped into the conversation, taking to Twitter to express his disbelief at Yachty's claims. He pointed out the irony of Yachty making these statements while wearing a New York-inspired outfit. Fabio's reaction added fuel to the fire, intensifying the debate. In the wake of the backlash, Lil Yachty attempted to clarify his comments, acknowledging New York's historical influence while doubling down on his belief that Atlanta is currently leading the fashion scene. Okay, so I guess that in in in, in my Cash Cobain interview podcast or study place, there was a conversation about people getting fly, and I made a comment about the Bronx. And I think I said that people from the Bronx can't dress. I think. I'm not sure. Something that upset people. People brought up Mapleton and whatever. But I'm. I just wanna. I, and I'm only talking about this because I was going through some of my clothes and I seen this New York jacket. Right. It made me think. It made me think about New York and people from New York. <laughs> And when I think about the history, uh, like just like trends and shit, not the history, because if you go back in a certain time, it's for sure New York. But if you think about lately, right? Um, trends come from Atlanta. Make the joke about me being from Ableton or whatever. That's cool. Mableton for life. First off, Mableton for life. Fuck niggas ain't ever been to that Mabel. Y'all know nothing about that Mabel. First. Second. All the trends come from Atlanta. It's all from Atlanta. For real, for ask at, what? What? I'm confused. Like I, I first off, I love New York. I got nothing but love for New York. And I think is, I think these, I think the a lot of the flyest people in the world were born in New York. That's a fact. But come on, bro. As of lately, Atlanta, and LA don't try and get in this. I saw LA trying to. I'm telling you, bro. When it comes to the flyest trend-setting people, it's Atlanta. You can argue with your mama. You can argue with your daddy. I see people from L.A. trying to get in the conversation. Nothing to do with this. I'm telling you, y'all. High socks and chinos. Chill. Atlanta. All right? Flyest, trendsetters, everything is Atlanta. Oh, 2005 Gucci jacket, by the way, Tom Ford. But um, Atlanta. You know what I'm saying? I don't. I apologize to the Bronx if they felt some kind of way about that comment. You know what I'm saying? I married down. Do your thing. You married down. Do your thing. Don't. I be in New York, so don't fucking y'all don't rob me. Don't rob me over coming. It was a joke. Um, but yeah, Atlanta. Thank you. Argue with your mother and your father. He even humorously asked the Bronx not to rob him, stressing his respect for New York. This debate highlights the deep-rooted pride and rivalry between these two iconic cities. Whether you're Team New York or Team Atlanta, one thing is for sure, both cities have left an undeniable mark on the world of fashion and hip-hop. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more exclusive content from the Red Carpet Re-Up. See you next time.